It's quiet. Too quiet. Greetings from the Eerie Coast. This is Mad Shad. Ha <laughs> ha. On this wonderful Monday. Wow. Beautiful day. Clear blue skies. In the 70s. It's a beautiful day. No rain. None of that in the... Yeah, uh, my birds are gone. I, my secretaries are out to lunch. I guess I don't know, uh, but yeah, it, it's a good day. It's a good day. I'll tell you about those who did not have a good day. Those Americans that are trapped in Afghanistan, left there by traitors, own militia slash incompetent regime. At least we forget. Thirteen service men and women died at Abbey Gate, Kabul, Afghanistan, along with two other poor souls. Three plus people lost arms and legs and limbs. Things that don't grow back. A lot of them were service members as well. Every day, never forget, and never forget whose fault this is deploy knife hands but there was hope folks getting him out task force Argo task force Pirate project X is project Donald Christian coalition mighty Oak Foundation just name a few and no our military our government they didn't help anybody yeah. the military tried they tried they did uh, but the, the the state Department of State said no no we ain't helping nobody Hmm. Yeah, it, it, it took once again we the people to get those folks out. <laughs> At least we forget that 700, 800 plus individuals are still incarcerated over the J six debacle. Hell, there's political prisoners without sentencing, without bail, torture, solitary con confinement conditions. Someone lost an eye. There have been suicides. A lot of moms and dads in prison. Every day, never forget, and never forget whose fault this is. And yes, definitely deploy more knife hands. Boom, 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 boom. Meanwhile, breaking news, breaking news, breaking news. SCOTUS. SCOTUS. Supreme Court has has made a ruling that Trump indeed does have immunity in his in official acts. So any official acts that he uh, that he pre that he did, he has immunity. Uh, so what are unofficial acts? And so that's that's the question they're asking. Everyone's asking right now. What's an unofficial act? Well, uh, <laughs> if if he has immunity against official acts, what about all those other presidents uh, um, that did not that 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 did unofficial acts in the White House? And yeah, thank you. Uh, <laughs> thank you, uh, Dan H. Uh, where's Bill? Right? Uh, he did a very unofficial act in the Oval Office. Mm, yeah, you know, remember that? You know, uh, Monica? What? I mean, I, I'm just saying. Uh, so, you know, uh, how many unofficial acts were, were, were uh, carried out <laughs> under other presidents, and why are they not being subpoenaed? Anyway, uh, and so the other question arises, what about Steve Bannon? Does he have to go to prison now? And what about the other guy, I forget his name, who's been serving a six-month term in, uh, in prison for the same, same thing, uh, to uh, refusing to testify against Trump, right? Now, I, I, I suspect that they're going to, you know, they're going to make it stick just because it was a it, it, you know, it was kind of like a bench warrant. You know what I'm saying? It, you, it, 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 they could have showed up and said, I plead the fifth. You know, we're, you're here under investigation. You're supposed to testify against so-and-so and so-and-so. Uh, and, you know, here you are. We're going to ask you questions. And if you just sit there and go, I plead the fifth, 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 fifth. I mean, so, uh, you know, I, I, I kind of I suspect that they're going to make it stick uh, because, you know, that's what they want to do. They want to put everybody. They they, they want to challenge uh, the uh, their 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 rivals, their enemies, uh, and put them in prison. That's that's how that's how this uh, subversion thing works, right? You know, you know, incarcerate or assassinate your uh, political rivals. <laughs> so uh, that's that's what they like to do. Um, so yeah, there's a there's a lot of discussion going on right now, and and thank you, thank you, Team Linda, for breaking news uh, for the uh, the the Trump immunity thing. Uh, she brought that to my attention. Uh, so yeah, uh, that's going on. Uh, yeah, 
Uh, meanwhile, uh, meanwhile, that's uh, you're going to hear the aftermath of that, so stand by. Uh, maybe I'll hear some of it. I don't know. I'm, I'm working, so I, I've, I've actually got to go here. So, uh, go Team Linda. Go Team Linda. Fuck cancer. She is kicking ass, taking names, getting strong by the day. Uh, go Team Joe Morgan. Go Team Joe. He is. Uh, go check out Joe Morgan's channel. He is. He is fighting the good fight. He, he he's at the point now where he, he is he's in a sober sober area. He's being sober. Uh, he hates it, right? Uh, as most people do, right? So, I I went through the same thing, the detox and all that, um, and just the the aftermath, you know, the year of aftercare and the constant, you know, counseling and meetings and oh my God, it's. Uh, it's it's you know and the other people that everything gets on your nerves everything gets on your fucking nerves uh you know just everything uh so it, it's it's it, very irritating and frustrating i know but uh you're doing the good work there joe uh on yourself so keep it up man keep it up you know suck it up and you will reap the benefits uh later on uh so anyway uh i've got to run this has been mad shad every day never forget